1944, Dr. Henry Sewell gave his home to the cause of helping people with special needs. And for the last 65 years, we have endeavored to fulfill his dream of reaching out into the community and serving those who have any kind of identified special need. Children with special needs learn and grow side by side with children who are typically developing. Uh, what a valuable lesson it is for any of us to learn when we're three or four or five that we can have friends that really are a whole lot like us or who are really completely different from us and that we can still, we can learn together, we can play together and ultimately we can work together. So children who are typically developing who come to Sewell, we have the research to show that they have the same um, learning growth that other children do, that they have all of the cognitive and language skills needed into their next environment. But in addition, they've learned empathy and compassion and how to interact with children of all kinds of learning abilities. My own children went through Sewell as kids who were typically developing, and I can tell you the level of compassion and empathy and ability to interact with children is greatly enhanced, and I believe it's because of being at Sewell. When he first started Sewell, he, was, he didn't engage with anybody. He just sat there and didn't want to play with anything and he didn't want to, he, he didn't even look people in the eyes. Over time he started to learn to engage with other children and the children were engaging with him and he was able to articulate what he was feeling and what he needed and I just saw the growth continue. I don't know what exactly it is about early intervention but I definitely saw the difference in how Andres has thrived and how much he's changed by coming to Soul Child Development Center and having this early intervention. The sooner we address those issues, the sooner we help that child get that speech delay under control, or the sooner we help that child learn to walk, or the sooner we help that child learn to deal with their social emotional issues and learn how to make a friend, the better off that child's going to be when he or she gets to kindergarten. Sewell has been a place where he's respected, where he's honored, and probably most importantly to me is he loves being here. You go into our classrooms and we have roughly twice the number of teachers and therapists that you'd find in a typical preschool so that children who are enrolled here really get the benefit of that extra attention from adults. Sewell is a nationally accredited preschool. Uh, we hold an accreditation from the National Association for the Education of Young Children. And across the country, fewer than 10% of all preschools are willing to go through the process of getting that accreditation. So that's a terrific indicator of the dedication of our staff and the quality of our staff and the programs that they have in place in the classrooms. I can't imagine working anywhere that would be more rewarding than working here at Sewell. Each and every day I get to see the difference that our staff make in children's lives when I see a little one go by my office today perhaps without a walker and yesterday that child went by with a walker. Or I hear them out in the hall carrying on a conversation maybe with just a few words but it's a few words they didn't have last week. So part of our choice for choosing Sewell was um, the, the fact that we had the ability to have Cal in an inclusive environment where he was not segregated with only children with disability, but he was also around typically developing children, um, which was really important because that was, that was what his home life was like, where he had a typically developing twin brother. So within two weeks of coming to Sewell, Cal was on his walker, and he was walking with the assistance of his walker, but he was up and you know, straight up and not crawling. And um, when you have a child who tips over constantly, um, falls down constantly, he can't verbally say necessarily what might be, he be, might be afraid of or scared of. It's really important to feel comfortable that you're, you're leaving him someplace for six to eight hours a day um, where he's going to be safe. I've been on the board for two and a half, almost three years, and I am so happy with my ability to give back to an organization. I don't know that I'll ever feel like I can give back as much as I've received, but I'll try. was the one unique one that had therapists, um, PTs, OT, speech therapists in each one of the classrooms as opposed to you know sort of roaming around in classrooms and seeing kids maybe for a few minutes at a time and we were really taken by the power of the teachers here and the dedication to the students. 
you know, it also works with kids that are economically disadvantaged. And, you know, so you're working with a population, a mixed population that all have different needs. You know, I remember one day where I, uh, I got a call from a school and, and Lainey had been using a walker because she was slow to walk but using the walker and they called me on my phone and said, you've got to come back to school. And I said, well, why? And they said, well, Lainey's walking. And the teachers were like cheering and crying and it was like a big deal because Lainey had dropped her walker and was walking along the playground. And it was just phenomenal because they had spent so much time, you know, working with her to get her into the walker and then out. And it was just a, you know, a phenomenal story. Sometimes donors will say to me, so where do the dollars go when I make a gift to Sewell? And one of the things I can say with great certainty is those dollars go directly into those classrooms, directly into helping the kids. So uh, our donors always feel really certain that their money is put to good use right away. And we feel really proud of that here at Sewell. At Sewell Child Development Center, young children of all abilities and learning styles come together to learn and grow. Sewell's unwavering commitment to full inclusion means that young children with special needs learn and grow with their more typically developing peers in our developmental preschool. In addition, we provide a continuum of early childhood programs to support children's development from birth through age eight. At Sewell, we are passionate about helping all children succeed. If you would like your child to be a part of our accredited, high quality programs, or if you're interested in joining our efforts to assist young children in our community, please call us at 303-399-1800 or visit our website at www.sewell.org.